Hey! You there? Can you help? Can you help me, mister? What's the problem? My goddamn horse got spooked and run off. Are you hurt? Not too bad, at least. But he took my damn leg. Sorry. He went that way, I think. His name's Buell. Buell? Second time a prick named Buell cost me a leg. Huh? Buell was my general when I lost it. Oh, uh, okay. Anyway, if you see an angry bastard of a horse with my wooden leg, I'd be real grateful. I'll bear that in mind. Calm you down. Easy. It's okay. Whoa now. Easy. Whoa now. Easy. Easy now. Whoa. Wait. Come on, Dan. Let's get you back. Yeah, he's just where you left him. Can't go far with that leg in your stirrup. Can't go bucking him like that. You better be good, you hear? I get the notion he's not a man you want to cross. No matter how big and strong you are. found him. You're a good man, mister. Mr. Arthur. You're right. He's a brute. <sighs> Amish Sinclair. Yeah, he's a great horse, aside from when the devil got him. Hey, you want to hand me that leg there, please? And while you're at it, give old Buell a kick for me, would you? No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Warren, but a snake that spooked him. <laughs> You're a real gentleman, you know? Sometimes, maybe. Yeah, how'd you lose a leg? Oh, in the war. Cannonball. Pretty clean, though. I don't have much pain, and I didn't get any gangrene. A young boy went into battle with me, got cut in half, so all things considered, I'm doing pretty well, I guess. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> so, uh, how is the false one? It's okay. <sighs> I can still hunt. Fish? Enjoy the outside. Weren't sent too crazy by it. Anyway, I ain't got much to pay you with. You know, that's okay. You like fishing? You can come with me someday. I know some pretty good spots. Well, I'm a pretty poor fisherman. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm great. So between the two of us, we do okay. 
My cabin is right over on the other side of O'Cray's run there. Thanks again. Yeah, you throw me again, you old dumb bastard. I'm gonna put a bullet in you. I'll see you again. Business at the mine. I'm looking for an Arthur Londonderry. I was told he works here. Londonderry? Oh, you'll want to speak to the foreman. He's down in the pit. Arthur London there. Clear? I'm sorry, feller, but you're too late. Arthur's dead. <laughs> the man's dead. What's wrong with you? Oh boy, you can't exactly beat it out of him now, can you? <laughs> you might get something off his widow just across from Butcher's Creek, but I'd hurry. You ain't gonna be the only one a knocking. <laughs> You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Hey, I ain't the godforsaken money lender. Fine. <clears throat> uh, Mrs. Londonderry. <coughs> Off is dead. I know. I'm sorry for it. Just, we lent Arthur some money, you see, and... So it was you. You son of a bitch. What do you want now? You want my boy's shoes? You want the food out of our bellies, what little there is? You want me to lie down for you? No, no. I... Arthur gave everything to pay your bills. Everything. And now there's some fellas coming to take the house. There ain't nothing left, mister! I uh, just wanted to say the debt's canceled and to you know, take this. It won't bring your husband back, I know. You need money and I don't. Why? Well, you're a good man. I just wish you'd done it before he worked himself into the grave. But, you know, maybe you and your friend that lent him the money could do things differently. Like, not threaten a man. Excuse me. I'm sorry, ma'am. I really am. Touch seems 
to have lost his mind? I know. Just be careful. I don't have to be careful. I... I have you as a friend. How did you get on, Mr. Morgan? Just dandy. Hmm. Just... Get up. What? Get up! What... what is wrong? Nothing's wrong. Nothing at all. What are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Get your bag. Is this it? I don't understand. I ain't gonna kill you. Though I probably should. You disgust me. And you shame us. If we could be shamed any more than we already are, that should do. Uh, go! I don't understand you. What are you doing? Go and get a job! You know, they, they say the sick delude themselves. I was your friend. You and me, we ain't decent. But those folk, they was. Now, yeah. Take that. Take that and get lost. I'm leaving. <laughs>